Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If you have not subscribed yet, guys, please go ahead and do so. That will help the channel tremendously. What are you looking at, guys? It's a battery that I purchased from Battery Clearance House. They call it B B A E System. This is the part number. Okay, I purchased this thing from Battery Clearance House, guys. Now inside of it. Is 39 30, uh, 96 cell with a one two three battery. Now let's check this thing out to see where I got it from. Here we go, guys. To the battery clearance house, that's where I purchased it from. Guys, this is the price. Let me take this thing off. This is the price of it. 90 cell 39 volt this is a this is a 36 volt okay guys now what i'm about to do i have two of them there is one i already disassemble i take a 12 volt and a i make a 12 volt out of it and a 24 volt out of it okay let me go get the battery and show it to you guys okay folks this is the battery that i that I have, that's the battery that I have. I cut this thing already. I have a video, I'll show you how to cut it. Okay, this is positive, and this side is negative. Where I'm gonna get, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut the other one, put it side by side, so I have the positive, the negative here, the positive there, or I can flip it in the other way, to have it that way. Okay, this is a 36 volt right now. I cut it, guys. I did cut it. Okay, let me give you a little bit. I'll show you the other side. Let me show you something here first. I can give you the tablet. This is the battery. This is how you get it. You go to the main. Go to the main. Guys, you go there. You go all product. And you go down. You want to get to this one? You think you go this way? There it is. Okay, this is the battery. The price of the battery, you can buy two of them. We said 38, this thing was not $38. There's a single pack for 38. There's one, this is 38. There was a 38 one. Okay, you can buy the pair. It costs out to be 72. And two cards, let's see how much the whole thing to be. Okay, and you go proceed, check out. And you put your address, your information there, and then you go purchase it there. And then they ship it to your house. I think the ship is about 30 bucks. I don't know. I don't remember, guys. Okay. I don't remember. So, I purchased two of them, guys. I purchased two of it. That's two. You see the price, guys? 72. I think the price went down for two of them but now what i'm gonna do guys i'm gonna take this guy and this guy is right there is the same battery i'm gonna disassemble this battery and make it like this and then merge them together so if you if you subscribe okay now this is a 12 volt so if you subscribe guys you help me out you get to see all the all the stuff i'm doing here now i have a different car i'm gonna show you the different car that i have and I had to cut it just like that and then make and add this portion to the 36 to make 48. I can do it that way. Okay, let me show you. See how long is the battery? Where I'm gonna place the battery, I can make it longer like that. It will be a lot easier. I just cut, I just buy it by four, I will have three sets of battery. But right where I'm gonna put this, it, it take too much space. So I, I can only cut every one of them. So I'm gonna, I have two of them. I'm gonna try those two to get 48 volt. This is it. This is a 12 volt battery. This is what I did with it, guys. I used the 12 volt battery to do spot welding. Okay. No, I'm not gonna leave it like this. I'm not gonna leave it like this because I'm gonna put it uh, back on the cover. Okay. Now this is the side that I cut. That's 24. I'm gonna cut cut the other side this way. I'm gonna cut it right there. 
That's exactly when I cut it. So this part was with, I think it's this way. I think I'm gonna cut it this way. Or you cut it from the other side. There we go, guys. I'm gonna cut this, the other one, the one I have here. I'm gonna cut it right here. So this side, Will be the will be the will be the next size to 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 line up with this one. Give me twenty four volt. Then those two batteries, I'm going to be using them. I got all the tools for them. I need those batteries for some something else. I have a car in Haiti. I'm going to ship this thing to the car because I use those batteries for car batteries. I do. So, without further ado, guys, let me go start cutting the other battery. Okay, folks. If you, if some of you did not see my previous video about how to take this thing off, let me give you an, ex an explanation of this. There's about several screws in here. There's one in here. This thing came from here. There's one here, one there. You can see all those things. You gotta use, let me tell you what I use to take this thing off. I use these guys to take this thing off, man. The same thing as this one here, let me show you how I do it. I press this against it and close. Okay guys, see, and close it. And I press it against it again and turn it. I keep going around it. I think I one here. Let me put the phone down. Lift it like this, guys, and I'm trying to rip it there. There we go. Now, once, once you clear it, guys, you take your screws. Yo, I, ha I use a gun. I use this guys. I use this guy. I stick it in there. And then screw it. That's it. This is done. Now, you do this for... You do this for all of them, guys. All of them. And this part, you just keep it, take it off. And this is the, what you call this thing? This is the thing you use for sensor. You take it off, this is done. That's it. And now the problem begins. Okay guys, and I do have a video on this, you know, so. And your left on the positive side, not on the other side, so you see? And this is gonna be in your right. The negative is gonna be on your right. And what you're gonna do, and you're gonna peel this side. This is gonna be in your left, in your left, because if you turn it around, the positive is gonna be on your right. But if it's and the way it is right now, you're gonna take the, the, peel this side. You peel the you you peel you take this side off. You will see the nuts in there to unscrew. And that's about it, guys. Okay, folks, you just peel it, guys. It's got a glue. Take the whole thing out. You won't need it anymore. You can toss it around unless you want to put it back, which it will go back. But I don't think I'm gonna need it back. Okay. And the screws will be. You can see the screws in there, guys. Let me take this, this thing to show you the screws. There's one there, one there. And it goes all the way through. We take all of them off. Then next thing you know is you're gonna these things will come out. You're gonna need certain thing to push this thing down. I have a video on that that tells you what it is. This is gonna be a nightmare for me. I don't have that much things here to take it off because it's gonna be a nightmare for me. You can you need something like plastic to go on the need of it. That's a 
bunch of them there, guys. Now we remove all of them. Guys, this is the positive. Usually there is three schools here. So far, there have not been no school here. Okay, I remove all those screws. Remove all the screws, guys. And there's two more. There's two more screws in here. Okay, two two up here. There's none inside of it, so he'll be fine. So now you gotta lift this thing up, guys. You gotta find a way to lift this thing up. I don't have any way. Uh, I don't know how long I'm gonna do, when I'm gonna do this, guy. I'm gonna pause this thing, trying to lift it up. Last time I did it, it gave me a lot of headaches. So, guys, I'm having, I was having a hard time with this. This thing can push, push down. This is what's stopping it. This thing right there. Somehow, somewhere, something is in there who's stopping it to come down. So I have a screwdriver. This thing, when I want to get there, I try this thing here. It will work. So I'm just going to push this thing down and break it. You're going to see how easy the thing come out. I just thought of it, guys. I didn't have it in the previous video, but this is better. Take the same screw you take out, just dump it in here, and screw that, and screw it back out. You see this thing come out easy. I had the same thing in here. I did it. This part is out. I'm going to do the same thing all over, guys. I'm not going to fight with these guys. Thing is gone. So guys, I'll just go. Let me see if it can come out easily. It will. So let's go do it on all of them. I have something here. And I get do that, guys. Where is it? Right there. Guys, yeah, you see how deep I push it down? I'm gonna remove it. <coughs> okay. There's another one over there, guys. There's another one on the other side. Let me do it too. Let's see if I get this thing rolling. Okay, let's go all the way down and push it back on. Let's do a couple more, guys. Let's do this one we did already. Because I didn't go deep. And this one too. Let's see if this thing can lift off, guys. Okay, so I'm gonna do all of them and fill it, lift it up, guys. I think this is already up. It's already up. Let me go ahead and complete that. Guys, this thing came out easy. It came out so nice. It was right there, and I took it out. I'm gonna push it to push everything down, and it works. Yep, this thing was holding it right there. This thing was holding it, guys. Right there, it was holding it. There's one there. It was holding this thing, so I did not fight with it. Did not fight it with it, so it's fine. We're good. I gotta flip it on the other side and do the same thing. Make sure there's no things on the bench. Bench is clean. No piece of wood in there. And then this thing will come out also the same way. Okay guys, the same way you got it. I flip it over, peel it off. Okay. And there's I gotta do the same thing here. You see where this thing stop it? 
you hold it. So you gotta try to push this thing down. I got a screwdriver, I got a method. I'm gonna push it down and then just lift this thing off little by little. Or oh, there's something else you gotta, you gotta move it around. This is easy. Push it down and twist it. It will come out. Twist it this way and it's good. See, it come out, guys. And those guys, they will come out too. Same way, push it down. Try to twist it and it will come out. Okay, do the same thing for all of them. And I will get this thing out in a few minutes. Guys, the reason I'm showing this, that's the reason you should, you should subscribe. Because I'm taking my time to do this. I was I used to have a hard time with it. I just found out a better way to do it. And I'm showing you guys this. Okay. This is to be hard to take out. Because I unscrew this. You have to push this down. There we go. You push this down. You stick this thing inside of there. I gotta take this thing off. Oh boy. Okay guys, this tab I gotta remove it. Once I remove this tab, I can loose them up. Okay. Let me see a better way to show you guys. See there is a tab there. I gotta remove that tab, make it free like this. They're not gonna touch each other. You see this thing? It has to be removed. Okay, all of them. For example, see those two tabs? You twist this this way. Okay, this is how I remove this. It's done. This one, I gotta do the same thing, guys. The glove is just because I don't wanna get cut. There we go, this is removed. This, I gotta use a screwdriver for this. A couple of them, I gotta use a screwdriver. Okay? So. It's almost done. Guys, all the screen, all the tab is removed. It's not attached to the thing. Now I can go and remove the thing. Uh, the, the, the cover. Yeah, it's so easy. Last time I was having a hard time, guys. I just want to show you guys. How easy it is. How easy it is. Last time I was killing it. And we just start pushing this down and everything will come up. Because you remove the thing I was holding in the plastic. Jesus Christ. Yes, I have no idea how hard this thing was to remove. See, this is plastic, guys. This thing again, okay. Last time I didn't do this on camera, okay. Move this thing this side, I'll start this way. Everything is moved there. Look at that, Jesus Christ! I have to fight with this thing, guys. Look at this. <laughs> I can't believe it. Guys, you have no idea what the thing was, the first one I removed. I had to fight with it. Now I know how to do this. If I don't, I gotta review the video. Okay. Look at this. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> this is what... Guys, I never did this before like this. This is the easiest way by doing a screwdriver. You see this thing was holding it. I just push it down, push every one of them down. You see, there's one here, one there, there's one there, one there. I just push it down, the thing came out easily. Okay. Now, I need, oh, I just gotta cut this thing. This is the, what you call this thing? The positive, the negative, this gotta, I don't need the wire. This is sensor wire. I don't need that. I'm just gonna cut those guys. Okay, because I don't need this sensor wire. Cut that. And this is removed. Garbage. 
thought there was two of them there. There was another one. It was, I think that one was cut already. It was a short one. Okay, guys. So now, in this battery, last time, last time, guys, I cut the battery in here. Take this part. Now, this time, I need this end. This end is positive. So I want to remove this negative because I already have the other side negative. So I'm going to remove this side. I'm going to cut it right there. And do I know that inside of this, guys? Let me get a. Okay, so let me get the meter. Okay. I'm going to check this thing for you. Or for this thing, say it. Yeah, you can see it. Yeah, we need to evolve. Watch me, guys. This is a negative, this is a positive. I got 12 over right there. It come out to be 13. I got to make a cut. If I go like this, that will be 6. There we go. 6 or 7. Here is negative. It's uh, 12. And if I can take here to here, that's another 12. And from this side to the... <coughs> from the other side, 12 again. You just get you 36 more. Now, I'm gonna cut it right there in the middle. Let me pause this and, and use a pen to show you guys that. Okay, guys, you see the line I draw there? Okay, that line, see, it's right there. There's a draw I have there. <coughs> I just cut the battery in half. I mean, into one third. I take one third out of it. Okay, remember. And the negative supposed to be on the right, your positive supposed to be on the left. You gotta cut it that way. This time, I don't need this. From what I'm using this, I don't need this. Okay, guys, I don't think I need this. I'm gonna cut this thing right there. And I use this. This is lifetime warranty if you break. Usually, this part is break. And you go to the store, get another one. They will give it to you. Because I have a video on that, guys. So, this, I'm just gonna cut it like this. This is hard time though. I gotta wear. I like wearing gloves because this is okay. Oh, he just cut easy today. Today he just decided to. You got it. He cut easy today. Don't know why. This thing never do do anything easy for me. I'm just gonna straight this thing out, guys. Okay. So I like using gloves because I don't want to get cut. So this is gonna be a lot of movement, left and right. You know. So make sure you keep it. Yeah, some tools some tools gonna go quicker. I don't have that tool. This is what I have, guys. So this is gonna do. So I'm gonna cut this thing in the middle. Okay. Okay, press it too hard. It's already cut. It's not that easy, guys. It's just being lucky so far today. Okay. So far, so good. Now, maybe this thing is brand new, I don't know. Guys, I just cut the first one. Let me pause this and see if I can do all of them. Uh, maybe my knife is like quicker. This never happened before. I was having a hard time with it last time. My knife wasn't sweet. This is brand new, guys. Can't believe the way this thing slicing it. Don't touch the skin, guys. The skin of the battery is a problem. Okay. That's the only side you gotta cut the metal because the metal. That's the only side you gotta do that, guys. Okay, I cut one. I got two more cut, guys. Okay. Here's another one. That's too close. See, sometimes people make mistakes. Can't go close like this. I'm trying to become more comfortable. See, those things can cut you. I went too, too close to this thing here. Let 
there's a plastic on the needle of it. Trying to trying to reach it from the side. I gotta flip this thing guys. To be more comfortable. This is the first time I'm doing this thing live on camera. Okay, I corrected it. Make sure you don't bend this, you don't kill it. I may say I got one more cut left. Okay, I'm cut. That's very close. Now I'm gonna have a problem, you can't miss that barry. Okay, now let's try to do this one, guys. Let me see. Yep, I'm seeing it right. Time to cut it there. Don't come close with that one there, guys. If I can go on the needle of this, make my life a lot easier. Yep, I guess I can't. and camera guys I'm almost done just being careful that's all I gotta flip this guys I have to flip I have to flip this to be able to see properly to make sure I don't cut this in the wrong way okay almost done guys This is the last one giving me a hard time. This thing can cut you like a so quick guys. <laughs> Gotta be careful. This is the only hard part in there. Okay, I'm almost done. Okay, I think it's done. Okay, this is done. The rest of it, use a little knife. Whoops, I can't believe I did this. Okay, can you guys see? Use a little knife, cut the, cut the stuff here. Cut the plastic. Plastic is easy to cut. Okay, this thing cut. Oh boy. Oh well. This thing is cut. Yeah, this cut. This guy is not cut yet, gotta cut it there. Okay, this one's cut. This is easy to cut. Oh, it's already cut there, let's complete it. See, this part is cut, guys, and on the back is the same thing. Okay, you're gonna flip it over. Guys, if you look on the back, yeah, it's a lot easier to slice it to make sure every bar, every, to make sure you do it right. See, look at the back, guys. Every back has two of them. Two, two, which is 36 volt. We just cut this thing down like this, guys. Okay. This thing goes this way. 
Yeah, this body goes this way. That one goes on the other side. This one the same thing. That's it. This is the body. This is the 12 volt. This is 24 volt. I'm gonna put 224 together. That's giving you what? 48 volt. Okay guys, this is my 224 volt. Okay, this is my 224 volt. You remember the other one? So now, this is gonna be my negative. The other one gonna be my positive, okay? So this is my negative. I'm gonna, I can put anything here to check the positive and the negative. Okay guys, now in here, I'm gonna draw a hole there. I'm gonna draw a hole there for, I'm gonna drill, drill and then the hole there. But for the time being, for this video, I'm only drilling only one hole here. Then I'm gonna use a 10 gauge wire. But when I'm gonna put this thing in function and test it, you will see how I do it. Right now, I'm gonna drill a hole here. And on the other side, I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Drill a hole, exact same spot. And to connect them together, to make it 12 volt, guys. To make it to a 48 volt. Give me a few minutes, you will see it. Maybe I can show you where I'm drilling the hole. Yeah, I'll do that. Okay, guys, this is what to be careful. Remember when I was cutting this? This thing was messed up. So for some reason, it touched the skin. It didn't push a punch in there. I had an issue like that, it puts a punch and I lost the, I lost the cell. And we didn't lose the cell, this is fine, the cell is fine. See? Now I'm gonna fix this later. I'm gonna drill a hole there, guys. I'm gonna drill a hole there. It'll be fine. The small hole I'm gonna drill to connect those two batteries. This battery's on the right side. I think I, I'm gonna do this one here, okay? Drill a hole there, but I will fix this in the future. I will fix this. Probably putting some salt and iron in there. Put the tip in the bottom of it. It doesn't get messed up. Get the connection. I, I cut it too close there, guys. Just a little bit of fire. Just a little bit of fire make it nice happen. Let me go ahead and drill the hole here. Okay, guys. This is where I'm at. So I put the screw there. I put the wires there. It's not completely done. So for the test purposes, I'm showing you this because I'm gonna cage this thing the same back it was came in. I'm gonna cut the backs in two pieces and get it the right way, guys. Now, this is the this is the negative of the wire. This is the negative. This thing is a negative of the. That's the negative, guys. That's the negative of the battery. So we're gonna connect it to the positive of the other side. Okay. Because what you're doing there is doing is 48 volt. You're gonna merge it there, guys. Okay. This hole is the positive. You see the positive are different. This is the positive, this is negative. Okay, this is the positive on the other side. Okay. See they are different. So I'm gonna tie this thing here. Tie this thing here to there. And that'll be my 48 volt battery. That'll be the end of this video because I do not know. I have a bunch of different ways to put it there. I'm gonna cut the tab. So I may have a second part of this. Guys, I decided to do this thing live. Let's see what happened there. So the other, a couple, a couple minutes ago, there was some fire. So when the thing burned, it touched each other. So I'm scared of power, I always touch it. I gotta make sure there's nothing goes in between these guys. Okay, they don't touch each other. There we go. Now the chances for to touch each other is zero. Okay, I'm still very scared of fire, you know. So, I put this thing right there. I put this thing here. Put this thing. Trying to bring them together right there, guys. This is not too big. Same look too big. Now it will fit. Oh, boy. Is that the same school the other one? They're all the same. I got no room to touch with this thing here. There we go. My finger get there. That's how I did it last time. I think I'm in there. Screwdriver. Let me get a screwdriver, guys. Where are you, screwdriver? Oh. 
to do anything with one left hand. This is so uncomfortable. Oh, the school fell. Jesus. I bet you the way it is now, the school fell down, guys. Okay. The skin of the battery is negative. Let me see if this thing can tie it. It's not tied properly, but it does. You can show you. If you come up here, guys, you see it. I got a smaller scooter than this, guys. There we go. If you touch this, this is positive, this is negative. The other one is positive. If you touch those two, they give you 52 volt. So my connection is correct. I gotta tie this thing up, guys. My connection is correct. I got 48 volt. That's a fully evolved batteries, guys. Now what I'm gonna do. And guys, don't forget to subscribe. This is a thing. This is I went through a lot to do this, guys. It took me more than three hours to do. I had to cut the video half, half, half. Okay, this is the situation here. Okay. Now, most likely I'm gonna cut all the the all the tabs gonna be gone. I haven't figured out how to do that yet. I'm gonna cut all the tabs and bring some wires where i can plug my bms but i'm gonna put this thing as i'm gonna put it on uh if you i can use all the tab actually except the end of it i don't want to use the tab because i want to cut the battery i'm gonna the frame i'm gonna cut the frame the right way so it take less space okay folks this is the end of this video Guys, I got my 48 volt, and the wire is not gonna stay like that. I gotta do it a little bit nicer, okay? Because that's where I'm gonna put it in the garage. I have a spot for this. Until then, guys, subscribe. Don't forget, don't, don't forget to share, comment it. This is a pretty nice video. It take me a long time to do this. Until then, guys.